But let's go and check out the celebrities on the big bike and find out who the ones were guilty of squirting people down D Street. Four. Well, the, the big bike, yep. it was um, the promotional thing that we did in conjunction with FADE and SAD, which is Students Against Drunk Driving, and we wanted to raise money um, for the students to go off um, to their national conference. Was it the hard work? Oh, yeah, it was, but it's not too bad. You're looking a bit wet, is that all sweat or water? Oh, a bit of both. <laughs> was it hard work? Damn hard work. <laughs> I tell you, are you, are you pedalling fast? Oh, pedalling like anything. <laughs> Were there any hard hills there, Lee? No, I didn't pedal at all. I'm the team. <laughs> is it hard and strenuous? Very much so. What sort of training have you put in to come along today? Hours and hours of strenuous training. Oh, on a bike? No, I'm a chair. Yeah, good on you. So you've been doing lots of sitting down? I have so, yes. Have you enjoyed it? Very much, yeah, it's great. How about you? You're pedalling hard? Oh, yes, definitely. Def what was the hardest point? Uh, going, around, going around the roundabout, going on three wheels. On three wheels? You nearly come yeah. across it. How about you, sir? Did you find it hard work? A lot of fun, a lot of fun. A bit wet at times, but a lot of fun. I could do some of this water, I'm thirsty. You're thirsty? How long have you been out for? Oh, nearly an hour. <laughs> nearly an hour. Have you been training hard for this night? Oh, yeah, yeah, walking up and down the stairs at work. <laughs> hard work? It was. The cops came along and tried to cuff me. They tried to cuff you? They, did cuff me. they obviously didn't succeed no. that well. I uh, pulled my hand out, so they're foolproof. They're foolproof. Okay, all those criminals out there, you now know how to get out of handcuffs. Come and see Joe McCauley. <laughs> back here at the back, drive sober there, written on the back there. Very important wee message. Tell me, sir, how was it? Excellent. Uh, was it hard work? No, but being a member of the underwater club would help. The amount of water that's around. Oh, strenuous. Yeah. Strenuous. Um, hard on the leg muscles? Extremely hard. Extremely wet too. Tell me, have you been at the gym for the last sort of three months getting prepared for this? Working very hard on the silicone, you know, trying to pump up, look good for the uh, event. But uh, yeah, it was great though. A lot of fun. And doesn't he look good? Thank you. It was a good ride, excellent ride, and um, I'm pleased with Invercargill's support. With a big bike. Yeah. Tell me, how did these celebrities that were here on the bike just now, how did they go? Excellent. I don't know who, who they were, but they're pretty good. <laughs> we went around the police station and it was set up by Kieran Price, wherever he may be, but he will wear it soon. He snuck off. Yeah, and um, he got the big fire um, hose and all the people in the back got way, way skirted, so it was, it was pretty cool. How many times have you um, guided this bike run in New Zealand? Uh, 400 plus, I think. 400 mm. plus. You must be getting pretty fit by now. Yeah, at Christmas time I put it on and, uh, and, and, and the tour I take it off, so I'm pleased with that. There was suggestion that there was a wee bit of help there, is that true? A bit of help? A bit of help. Something in the form of a motor? No, 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 no motor at all, no, no, no it's motor. All, all pedal power. So 30 person Street. power? 30 person pair, incredible stuff. We had the tyres smoking, you'll probably notice that. It says smoke free, but it's not true. They did actually smoke. They smoked. They smoked, smoked at the heels. Were smoking. <laughs> Takeoffs were incredible. Do you make a habit of doing this sort of thing? Oh, yeah, usually once a week. Once a week out on the bike? Yeah, not, not too bad. Have a bit of trouble getting enough people. <laughs> Have you ever done anything more than a, a one seater bike before? Mm. Yeah, I've been on a tandem. Can't say it was very successful, but I've been on it. Which was harder, the tandem or this one? Definitely the tandem. It was in Timaru, there were hills. Only two people compared to 30? Yeah. If you're at the back, see, so you've got the right idea, you don't have to pedal. <laughs> have you been doing much training for this uh, strenuous job today? I don't know, I think I should have been. Tell you one thing, the seats are very hard. <laughs> there wasn't many people saw us actually, we were probably so fast, it was a shame. That... Speed of lightning? Yeah, we're thinking about going back again, doing it again. Right, well next time you'll be leaping over uh, tall buildings, tall buildings in a single and you're onto it, yes. Yeah. Is there a phone box somewhere I want to change? <laughs> For the driver. Yeah, I think they do deserve three cheers. Apparently they raised $1,100 and that went to Fade and also Students Against Drunk Driving, so thoroughly well.